forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Lumos! This is no ordinary vault. I, was hoping I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Or Stay close. Sort of there will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Hey, as long as we stay from, away from more dragons down here, we good. Revelio. Nope. We're pretty rain for this one. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Rebellion. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Ooh. Lumos. All right, we'll try. Nope. Good enough. Lumos light. Oh. Lumos. Oh, well okay. done. Got it. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Professor Figs! Mm. Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to... Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again.
Lumos. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Lumos. Okay. 
Hello. Are you there? Professor Fig. Yeah. Professor? God, Sir? God, I'm glad you're all right. I'm somehow back in the entry room to the vault. I don't see a way to open the door. There must be something. I'll keep Revelio. it. Revelio. floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. Pensive. That is a pensive for viewing memories. No, pensive. Come on, Dumbledore it. I wonder. I'm gonna get some memories now. Follow my lead. Somebody's memories. Just some guy home decorating. All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Hmm. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for so centuries. So really, the dragon needed to eat and you, me, it seems. and didn't even know it are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. Dun, dun, dun. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. Found um, memories. <laughs> can I give you that? Uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. I have no patience for traitors. I have skulls no. on my shoulders. Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Oh, thanks.
right. Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Oh yeah, Hogwarts. The Express. Good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank I mean, you. I don't know anyone yet, so... Ready for the sure. sorting ceremony? Awkwardly and walk in in front of everyone else. Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were... complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. Lucky? <clears throat> All I do is put I'll on be a in hat. touch. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm. I wonder... Hmm. Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Hmm. What is it?
is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong oh, in spirit. the magics. How'd you know, Hat? How'd you know? You belong in Slytherin! Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury we on the know. pitch in last you spring's in final, Slytherin this year's Black. Quidditch we season know. has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. But Quidditch is hard. You are here to focus on your academic Program. futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Plus DLC. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Some sort of special. Quite an Quidditch tournament. It's lovely to meet you. Nice. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As deputy oh, headmistress, it is my distinct is honor to show you to your great, 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 great grandmother. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. You said aspiration. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Looks like everyone's gone. Better oh. head to the common room. Oh well, give me a second. Don't be pushy. Gotta check all the things. Dormitories are adorable. Thought they'd be more, you know, hard and like, er, I don't know. It's got a rustic feel to it. Nice 1800s. Rose cups, rose decorations around here. Can I break stuff? <laughs> Sorry, that lamp was so pretty. 
Mm, that's good. It's an owl perch. The little box at the bottom that catch their droppings. <laughs> that door though. That floor though. It's like copper. That rusted copper color. Oh. Okay, come on, that's why. Slytherin common room girls, or common room dormitories, are adorable. Quite cute. Now, they definitely could have gone full evil, death eater, dark, you know, the whole Wednesday vibe, you know? And the Slytherin house is all water themed, as we are underground, um, and on the side, so as you'll see when I enter the common room, the Slytherin I suppose some introductions are in order. Backs up right to the lake. Must be different. So Starting the windows you're seeing, um, that's water out there. I want to talk to people. <laughs> okay, I will. But Sebastian first. Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. <laughs> I mean, it's probably quick. Death by dragon chomping. Professor Fig and I were lucky to escape with our lives. Indeed. And how did you escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean Magic. to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. But not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Mm-hmm. That's why I talked to you first, dude. Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. Give me a book. Give me a book. I want your book. Okay, check out this waterfall first. Anyone been into Aldi Weeks' shop lately? I'm always looking for an excuse to go to spin witches, even if I can't afford a new broom. Mm, I'd love to have, have a house. To buy a broom. My house. For a Saturday, when I think I'm standing in water. Sorry. Oh, 
I'm just talking in your heads because I can't hear you. Chess? Are you playing wizards, Chess? Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. You should have listened to me. Oh, ah, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic I mean, on your first day, it is taking weird. all the attention away from the first years. Be a fifth year. I'm Amelda, by the way. Anyway. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills in a broom are legendary. All right. Yeah, yeah. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, Could, I'd like wow, to get in what, some time what, on my broom what? before classes. Who? Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Good point. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing you like swerving time? through the spires of the castle and around the quidditch time pitch magic? to clear the mind. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye, Imelda. Nice meeting you. See ya. Aw, puppy. Yeah, the rose theme throughout. Didn't expect that. Bitchies. I really hope we get to see, or at least hear one today. I mean, those kind of look like catfish. What but do you think about it? Pretend. It's fine. It could be catfish. Probably not a super deep lake. They look like a mixture of catfish mixed with salmon. Where's the kraken? Over. Make a mess already. I like to look. Rugs on rugs on rugs on rugs. I I think I heard one. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fish. Ominous, your name is Ominous. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. I'd much rather have arrived on time and without a dragon attack en route. I'm sure. How horrible. I can only imagine. 
Well, it's good to have you in awesome. Slytherin. Watch someone Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here. I mean, I'm a little traumatized, but cool. Cool, cool, cool. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders okay, well, of Okay, well, that is extra sus. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Thank you, like Ominous. You're a little very nice to, to meet you. Cool. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. You sound very powerful. Is the new very fifth powerful. year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. All right, Violet, coming right away. Maybe after I touch a couple more things. Yeah, the roses. 